Alright, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21. Little bit of news for y'all, man. Patch one is dropped. I guess it's just a, the launch day patch. Day one patch, whatever it is, 1.91 gigs on uh Xbox. I don't know what it was on PS4 uh, 5, man. Who knows? Um, all I know is it took me about 30 seconds to download and then we was in there, man. But look, uh, we have some information on it. Uh, there's a whole article on it that just dropped, and I'm gonna drop this information for y'all right after this. So if you don't do nothing else, like the video, man, because we're bringing the 2K heat every day of the week, bringing you the most up to date content on 2K. Got a great jump shot coming out, the best jump shot in the game. It goes through the chop, it goes through everything, man. If y'all can get 500 likes on the video, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put that out. And uh, make sure y'all subscribe, and please turn on post notifications. I got somebody been subscribed to me for nine, for 11 years since 2009. He told me today, Jay. I'm not getting all your videos because I didn't know I didn't have on post notifications. So when you go to post notifications, hit the bell, hit all, so you get all of my videos, man. Uh, subscribe, turn on post notice, and I'm gonna be right back right after this. Nino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me upset. Start hustling nonstop, don't plan on breaking that head. All right, so... What we got, man, is uh, NBA 2K21. Ooh, I told y'all this shouldn't be a dangerous, man, bro. But, uh, hey, this is what we got, man. NBA 2K21 next-gen face scan update for PS5 uh, and Xbox Series X, man. That's the update that we were talking about on yesterday. And uh, pretty much, that's what we got. That's not all that we have. But, you know, we got some other things, but that's really what, that's that's the major portion of what we got. So we just gonna go through this real quick, man, um, or as quickly as possible and just see. Now the NBA 2K Next Gen launched just just this past week. Uh, the game, the games, uh, the gamers able to ball out as new consoles also debut. Look, man, what the world? With gamers able to ball out as new consoles debut. Bro, look. I don't know what they're talking about, bro. It ain't been too much balling out here, but you know, um, it, it, it is what it is. So the update, uh, the update received the launch day patch. Let me see, this new version, let's just go through it, man. The new version of NBA 2K game received a launch day update with more on the way. Basically, there will be a number of NBA 2K next gen face scans added into the game. And this was the whole thing that Eric Venice was talking about. Uh, the article that he was talking about yesterday, he put out the Twitter video. We saw the Twitter video. I actually covered it on a, a different story. And uh, it was Eric Benish. And uh, I know how to say his name now, so I'm going to say it. But uh, Eric Benish said that, um, you know, we did the updates. Uh, let's let's just hear what he, are we going to hear what he has to say? Uh, we already did, man. He, he pretty much said that there were, that they have a lot of updates. Um, and there were like a 40 additional faces that they were able to scan and they will continue to they're going to continue to do this as uh, as time goes on. So as time goes on, uh, they were limited because of the whole, uh, you know, the whole cold coronavirus deal and all that good stuff. Because they were limited, they had to, uh, they're having to do periodic updates with this. And these are the first 40 players that they were able to get scanned in because they said they didn't have access to the NBA players when all of that happened. And uh, with that being the case, y'all see Chopper City in the ghetto in the background. Let me know if y'all know what that's from, man. But, um, I, uh, you know, like he said, uh, that was the major thing and then we had some other minor additions we previously reported about about uh how the new uh, nba 2k next gen game for both the playstation and the xbox series x was uh was said uh let's see was said to take over uh to take over 120 gigabytes of space on the xbox and around 150 gigs on the ps5 uh, damn people used to talk about the superior console used to be able to have uh have the less gigs like this like playstation that used to be like a 10 gig download for xbox and they'd be like well it was only 20 gig i mean it's only uh, fear, uh two gigs on playstation superior console i wonder what they're gonna say now anyway uh 100 150 gigs however the day one launch update wasn't that big in size uh due to not having a ton of things to update and like we said there wasn't a whole a whole heck of a lot to update uh let's say in addition to the new faces uh Bennis mentioned that they that there have been a few other additions to the game. They included the bait face mask below, and uh, according to the Real Sports, according to Real Sports 101, find an NBA 2K banner uh, issue in the game. So it's the Duke Dennis patch, man. I guess that's what we're gonna call it because uh, NBA 2K 
Real Sport 101. They found an NBA 2K21 banner in the game. It was not an NBA 2K21 banner in the game. It was an NBA 2K20 banner in the game. I can verify that that has been updated and it has been fixed. And you do got the bait, uh, the bait face mask, man. I, I, what do y'all think? Y'all now digging the COVID mask and stuff, man? I actually am digging the mask. I'm not going to lie to you. I think they cool. I think they look cool. Um, and I mean, you know, they, they cool as far as the game goes. But uh, they don't add a whole lot, if anything, to the game. Like, we want to play basketball. It's cool to be dripped out. It's cool to be. Look, I mean, do you see how damn drippy my player is right now? This is superior drip that we are looking at right here. That you can't, you can't even. I don't even know if you can get. Look at the superior court vision. Superior drip equals superior court vision. Even with the choppiness, even the choppy city in the ghetto, I can still get buckets out here, man. So you know it is what it is. But I said there may have been, uh, there may have been some minor glitch fixes uh, here as well. Let me see. Uh, I just wanted, just wanted y'all to be able to see it. There might be some, some minor glitch fixes here, here uh, as well. But otherwise. This wasn't a huge uh, NBA 2K20, uh, 2K21 Next Gen update. Nonetheless, the Next Gen game appears as if it's been uh, popular for the most part. There's been a few complaints here, uh, here or there, as with as with most games. But overall, it seems like the win. Uh, it's a winner on the console. Next week, NBA 2K plans to celebrate 21 years of their game with an event called 2K Fest. Uh, let's see. It will it will feature NBA 2K stars and legends, uh, stars and legends as well as influencers and musical performers in major online, uh, in major online events. In a major online event, the event will take place on November 20th and continue for 24 hours via stream on Twitter, Twitch, and uh, YouTube. I have not been contacted about anything with that. And so I cannot tell you anything about that. As the foremost, as the foremost authority on 2K content and the foremost uh, 2K content creator, as that dude dies a horrible death, um, right? I, I've not been invited. Um, I'm the foremost influencer as well. Like, like y'all don't know who I am right now. Like, it's not y'all's fault that y'all don't know that I'm the foremost influencer on 2K. You know what I'm talking about? It's it's really uh, 2K's fault. It's either 2K, it's not 2K's fault either, it's YouTube's fault. Cause YouTube, like I just don't understand, like my stuff don't go out and stuff like that. But that's cool though. Uh, but one thing that I can assure you that did not happen in this patch, this was not a server optimization patch. I seen some people on Twitter saying, you know, after the patch and all that stuff, that the game was running smoother for them and things were better and maybe this was resolved that issue. This did not resolve the server issues. The server issues were, uh, they, they haven't been worked out and it seemed like it was better because people have garbage internet for the most part. We don't have, no, not everybody has internet like I got. And you probably gonna see at the end of this video how good my internet is because I'm gonna show y'all down, show me download the patch. but. A lot of people don't have like awesome internet like 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 I got or what have you. I had garbage internet for years. I had uh what after dial up in this place where I live now, the only thing I could get for most for most of the time was just straight DSL and then I could only get cable internet and they would only give me like a hundred down and like five up. Imagine that trying to be a YouTuber with five up. It literally took like 30 minutes to an hour to, to upload a 400 megabyte video or something like that. It was crazy. But now don't let me don't even get me started with uh walkthroughs. I had to buy two internets off the same thing just to be able to to survive. I couldn't do anything. It just locked my internet up when I tried to do it because of the acknowledged packets and stuff. But y'all don't care about that. But anyway, look at the superior court vision. It didn't it didn't fix it didn't fix the choppiness. There wasn't a server uh there wasn't a server uh optimization joint. And um the reason that people might have noticed less choppiness and stuff like that when when the game uh, updated was because so many people were still downloading it and it kicked everybody out the park. Never afraid to take a shot. Two piece, uh, trays up, splash down. Uh, people, people were kicked out of the game. They had to do the download. Some people took longer to download than others. And um, and so when we got back in, cause Shake got great internet, Prodigy got good internet, and I have great internet. Um, once we got back in, it was one of those issues where there weren't many people in the city because everybody else was still downloading. But I can I can assure you that I played for like an hour, and as people began to load in and load in and load in, it got choppier and choppier and choppier. So this that that issue is not resolved. The chopper city in the ghetto it still prevails, man. So y'all know, and if y'all wanna 
Y'all think I'm playing or what have you. Look, this game right here, bro, I can't say I carry it, but damn, I was hooping this game, bro. Some of the stuff I was doing was amazing. But uh, we just gonna fast forward. Look, they kicked me. I was sitting here, sitting here playing the game. He shoots, I got kicked. And I was like, yo, what's going on? And uh, I tried to go back in and bye bye. There we go, had an update and this was it. So like I said, you see the update going on. Um, you see the superior internet, all that stuff. I'm so happy that this not, okay, so the reason that you can download things faster is, I think the, I think the old Xbox has had like 54, this is not sped up or anything, cause you see it says 41 seconds, right? So this is in real time. But um, the Xboxes, they didn't have the high speed storage. So now, now, so back then it didn't matter how fast the internet was because they had the spinning hard drives or what have you. And I think they were like 5,400 RPM hard drive. Y'all know how, how God awful slow them joints are. But uh, with this, with the high speed storage, it can not only download it quickly with the gigabit pipe, but it can also convert it to uh, to storage almost instantly. So that's why these, these joints is not gonna take long, man. Like, and it says a minute and some, bro. That's, that's not gonna take half that long. But anyway, like I said, the chopping, it continues, it sucks. I know y'all tired of it, I'm tired of it. We need that optimization patch, we want that optimization patch, and we just need 2K to take us seriously with this thing, man. We know that the game wasn't built from the ground up, it's cool, we we love it, We you like it, I love it, I want some more of it. Look, we know that there's gonna be issues the first day, but right now, it's, there's just too many things going on. We got badge glitches, we got slow progression, and a badge is glitching where you're not getting your badge. We got two, the progression is just too slow with uh, rep and stuff like that. And then last but not least, the, the one thing that I really hate the most is that uh, is that the badge rep, the badge, the badge rep is just terrible right now. I don't even know like what you gotta do. Now you can go to the rare houses and play games, you can do other stuff, but it just seems like badge progression is just god awful slow, doesn't it? I don't know, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. But uh, I know I already talked too long, man. Uh, look at the game loading up right there, bro. This is just, it's just in real time. The high speed storage is a beautiful thing. Not gonna lie. High speed storage equals high speed access. And that means we can download things more quickly and we can access things more quickly. And it used to be like, bro, this used to take forever to get into the park. But if you, let's see if you don't got a PlayStation right now. I just wanna, look, look at this. When I click this, one. All right, look, when I click go to the park, look, one, two, three. We back in the park, baby. It is what it is, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Make sure y'all subscribe, turn on post notice, and I'm gonna at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Gosh,